Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Node.js. Today we are going to learn about how to upload an image into your Node.js application. It's just like the user profile when we have a user profile and there is avatar that we have to upload. That tutorial all about is right. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. In this series, we are going to learn about that how to upload an image, how to update an image, delete an image and how to get fetch the image. Right. So all this crud image we are going to learn in this series. So let's get started. So first of all, let's go to the code. So here we have the main file that is called the index file where we have a listen that is on the port number 4000, 4, right? So here we have an app listen to the 4000, okay? So now in the main one, then we have a require app. So go to the app.js file or whether you can make a one file that is called app.js, okay? So here what we have to require the basic library that is express you have to add npm i express npm i mongoose npm i body parser then multi right these npm packages we require so you need to install these packages right after that this is the connection of the mongodb so we are using the mongodb to add the data into our database okay so this is that one then we have a user Okay, so this is a st static images where it con it gonna be served from the images served from the storage and the images, right? So that one, and this is the routing for the all the routes where where we come from. That is API v1. Okay, then we have a multer file error handling. So any issue that multer occurs, so it will throw it over here, right? So here we have app dot use any error we are getting so it will throw the code and the error message right okay the next one that is here we have undefined route if any route that is undefined it will throw the error that the route not found okay so this is a basic app.js file then we have a routes file right so the first models so here we have the models so we have taken the name email phone active or inactive or avatar that is called image that we are going to upload right so this is the model part and here we are using the mongoose. Okay, then we have a routes first first route that we are going to use that is create user. Okay, so here we have a users controller file upload then this one. Okay, so go to the create user. So here we have the users controller where we have a mongoose model require FS method and directory. Okay, so here you can see that create user the simple one. So here we have taken the image that is come from the user here we are making the image that is storage and the images payload of that then we are putting into the image url and then we are going to user payload the save the image and user create a successful else it will throw the error 501 code right so this is basically user creation with the image upload right so let's check the next step that is called the how to upload the image because this is basically getting the image because here we have the multer function that will come into the role so here we have the utils file upload right so when we have the file upload so this is the basic code for the file upload we have a storage that is use the multer for destination and the file name so in in that format the file name gonna be happen we'll show you here file field name date and the extension and the original file name then file upload the multer does okay so here we have the image only which images we are accepting that is png jpg and jpeg right so this is the filter of that one and here we have a single dot image okay then exports dot file upload so whenever we have in a users controller then we have a file upload right in the utils we have routes this is the utils right file upload okay so here we have already file upload storage images then create user so all the images are stored in the storage images right okay so this is the file upload let's try go to the postman and check whether it's to be completed or not so i have already made that one so here we have a name so i'm going to make it test and make it this one 901 and i'm going to upload the image so this is the image let's take on this one okay so i'm taking the image that one send this and here you can see that 
the image is uploaded with this name right okay so here you can see that control and click okay so here we have a local storage images it's not in the images it is in the storage so just make to sure add the storage slash images so it's there already you can see the storage and the images the image which we have uploaded that is in the that one image you can see that the image path here where it is where it is postman so here you can 16851 so here you can see that right in the front in the uh, like the in this one so it's gonna be like the storage images not that means that route is not defined that's the reason because this is not defined because here you can see that where it is in the index uh, in the app.js so whenever the, the route is undefined so it will show here and app.use storage and the images slash user let's check this one slash user okay so you can see that the path is basically to serve the static images that is user and the storage and the images for the and the image name so it will give you that one okay so this is how we are uploading the image with the help of with the profile user right so basically upload image to the using the multer into the database also okay you can see the database also it's there so robo mongo so all the informations are there connection so it's basically user data users data collections view documents so here you can see that image name is there right so this is how we are able to upload the image using the multer and the you can say that the user avatar image right any doubt any query let me know in the comment section in the next next one we are going to list of the list the urls right so let's meet in the next video thank you so much for watching this video have a great day